What is up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. PNW Card Collector here back with another video for you. Today we are going to do a, I don't know if you want to call this a blaster box or not, but a gems of the game box. I'm going to call it a blaster box, but I don't know if that's what it is. There is one graded card in here, one autograph card or relic, sorry, one autograph or relic card, and then six factory sealed packs. Now, you're not guaranteed to get a BGS card or a PSA card in here, but it is guaranteed to be 9.0 or higher. I have seen B, uh, BCCG cards and uh, some some of the other lower, um, lower end grading companies, I guess, is the what I'm looking for there. But yeah, they don't, there's no odds or anything on this box. So I have seen um, that some people have pulled some pretty cool packs out of here. Um, older packs even, you know, from 17 and 18. So, um, but I think you're gonna get a lot, there's probably some, a lot of 1920 in here, um, if I had to guess. But there's a chance at Optic from 19, um, 19 Absolute, Illusions, yeah, so let's get into it, check it out, see what we can find today. Hopefully we get something really cool. I might have to get, let me get my scissors real quick. Just because it'll be easier to get into the box this way. I cut all my, uh, what I like to call my girl nails off. I cut them all off, so it's a lot more difficult to get into the boxes now. I used to be able to just sit here and go like that and slice it right open, but... Cut all my nails off. They're bugging me. Alright, so we are going to save the graded card for last. I think, you know, we'll probably save it for last and it'll be a dud. But So we have a 2018 Prism 4 card pack. Then we have a 2013 Tops 2019 Contenders Draft. There's our hit, so we'll leave that in there as well. Then we have hit draft uh, from 2020, leaf 2020, and hit 2020 here. Uh, looks like we can find Burrow, Tua, Swift, Taylor, CD Lamb. So kind of some dud packs. We'll open those first. Um, leaf, of course, is that's yeah, it's pretty yeah. Uh, We'll do that first. It's kind of garbage, but that's okay. We'll open it anyway. I actually opened a few of these early on in my channel days. So we got Clavon Chasen, Michael Pippen Jr. That's an okay name. Albert Okwagbonum, Boonum, Denzel Mims, and Barry Sanders flashback. All right. I have never actually opened any of Hit. So we'll do Hit Draft first. I've actually, uh, I've bought a couple, you know, I bought a couple of lots of cards um, where, uh, you know, there was some hit in those cards, or in those lots, rather, um, but I've never actually opened any, any hit cards either. So we got Kenny uh, Willicks, Ross Blacklock, Isaiah Coulter, Jonathan Taylor, and Joe Burrow. So we hit a Burrow, I mean, it's a hit, so it's kind of a... I don't know if trash product is the right word. It's kind of a low-end product. I don't, I don't know. Maybe trash is the right right word for it. I don't know. Um, but we hit a burrow, so I can't complain too much. You know, um, good name. Hopefully, he comes back uh, real healthy this year and and just blows the competition out of the water. That's what I'd really like to see. So this one's 2020 as well, um, Hit Football, Premium Edition, and there's eight cards per pack in here. And according to the back, we are looking for exclusive green level base autograph cards, um, low and high series trading cards numbered 1 through 100, peak performance autograph cards as well, and other premium inserts. So, yeah. All right, let's see what we find. Starting us off, we got T. Higgins, Jordan Love. That's an all right name. 
um, Kalik Hudson. I don't know that name at all. KJ Hamler. I recognize that one. Cole McDonald. Oh, we got an autograph. Kelly Bryant. That's cool. And it's hand numbered, four of 200. So can't complain about that at all. We got a hit in this box besides the one that we're supposed to get. Uh, DeAndre Swift, this right here, this one actually felt like it was a heavier card. So I didn't realize it was two cards here. Um, and then Sage Lewis, I don't recognize that name either. I do, I do recognize Swift, of course. Um, but yeah, we got a autograph, so we can't complain about that, I guess. That's awesome. Let me sleeve that up real quick. And let's look at the back. Congratulations, you have received a one, or received one of a limited number premium draft rookie autograph cards. Uh, Sage Collectibles guarantees authenticity, so on and so forth. So that's cool, Kelly Bryant. Can't pl can't complain about that at all. You know, it's I really wasn't expecting to get an autograph, so I like it. We'll put that back there with the burrow, even though it's again it's hit, so it's not the most desirable. Um, I don't think they even have. I think they're kind of like, you know, I hate to say it, but. I think they're kind of like Panini for baseball, and so I don't think they have any uh, rights to team logos or team names. Let me know in the comments below if I'm wrong on that, but I, I don't think they do. All right, let's get to, uh, let's do Tops first. Tops football. I'm not sure who we're looking for out of here. This is a retail pack, of course. It's got the built-in hanger here so you can hang it on a rack um, that's what we're looking for if you want to take a second pause the video I'm not going to take too long to hold it there I'm kind of excited to get into it as well all right so we have Morris Claiborne let me get these uh, cards out of the way real quick so I've got some room all right, Morris Claiborne, or Claiborne, NFC West champion, San Francisco 49ers, Tony Romo, Geno Atkins, all pro. There's a Matt Ryan, Patrick Peterson, Brian Hartline, or 1,000 Yard Club, Theo Riddick, rookie card, Luke... Jokel. I don't, I don't recognize that name either. There's a Keenan Allen rookie card. I don't know that name. Marcus Wheaton and Doug Martin. Okay, so we have two packs left. I'm going to save the prism for last. We got 2019 Collegiate draft picks. Hopefully, we'll hit something cool in this one. All right. If the pack would tear properly. Okay. Pardon me, I feel like I'm going to sneeze. I don't want to sneeze all over the cards. All right, so we got Jared Goff. Adam Thielen, Marquise Brown, Earl Campbell, Terry Bradshaw, and Antonio Callaway. So nothing big out of that pack. And our last pack, before we get to the hit and the graded card. All right, so this, oh, that looks like a cut in the middle of the pack there. It's not, it's not open, but it's what it looks like. Hopefully we can hit something cool out of here. This one, although, you know, one thing I'm looking at here, that bothers me a little bit. That looks like it's a resealed pack almost. You know, I could be wrong, but that's, that bugs me. So I'm not a huge fan of that. I hate when I see packs like that. Maybe the seal just came undone, but that, to me, looks like it could be a reseal. Um, let me know what you guys think in the comments below, but... I mean, I would like to think that it's a uh, 
you know, a good product and whatnot, but I don't know. That kind of has, that, that bothers me. So, it's supposed to be four. So there's another thing that bothers me right there. There's supposed to be four cards per pack. I got an expired kid reporter and three cards. And these are not prism cards. This is a resealed pack. I am going to, uh, I think I'm gonna file a complaint with this company because, um, yeah, we got Gerald McCoy, Will Fuller, and Kamar Aiken. This is a resealed pack. So yeah, we're, we have a problem. Um, I'm gonna send this video into the company. This is ridiculous. This should not happen. Uh, Don Russ cards in a prism pack. That's, that's not cool whatsoever. Yeah. All right, well, I'm a little angry right now. And of course they threw the kid reporter in here. Anyways, let's get to our, our hit here, what they're calling the hit. Let's see here, we got Jake Locker, Gold Leaf Rookies. Uh, looks like that's from 2011. It is numbered 73 of 299. Huh. And Jordan Love. That's cool, I suppose. It's a ten, but I don't know. I'm still I'm still a little angry right now. Um that is you know, I, I hate to say it. You know, I don't like I don't want to use bad language on the on my, my channel here, but that is a bunch of crap to find Don Russ cards in a prison pack. Um, yeah, I, let's see. Who is it? Does it say on this box who makes this? MJ Holding. So, hey, MJ Holding, um, I'm going to send this video to you, and I hope you make this right, because this is wrong. Um, let me know in the comments down below what you guys think, but to uh, find a pack that has been obviously resealed and find Don Russ cards in it is absolutely um, asinine. And so I am going to definitely be emailing this company and uh, I'm gonna find out what, what can be done about it. So um, this will be, I guess, a to be continued video. Hopefully we can, uh, I don't know, figure this out and make it right. Thanks for watching everybody. If you haven't done so already, make sure you smash that subscribe button, hit the thumbs up button below the video, um, leave a comment down below, let, uh, let MJ Holdings know that what they did or you know and i'm not saying it's their fault i don't think they searched the packs but to put a search pack in there is just wrong so uh yeah i uh hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you did again hit that thumbs up button hit the subscribe button and we'll catch you on the next one take it easy everybody